What is up, guys? It's Happy here, playing Cloud Punk. Let's just get into it. All right, let's get this package and uh, see where we have to go next. I meant to ask you, are you still off the music? You make it sound like I gave up drinking. Well, at one point, you must have loved playing music as much as I loved drinking sake. I don't feel like playing my flute here. Because you feel your music will get tainted by this place? <sighs> yes. At least you can listen to the music stations while you drive, though, right? I guess so. So, what are you listening to right now? I know, I'm an old man and I should like McSwigan and Beethoven and the Bunk Rats, but I really like that new pop idol, Dolly. I met her. Wait, what? Really? You mean that was the VIP you picked up? Kinda. What was she like? Like everything in the city, she was more complicated than I expected. I helped her with some management problems. You want to be careful, kid. Showbiz is more dangerous than driving deliveries in the hollows. I know. <clears throat> so, you don't have time for any music now? I like that comrade Bob. Oh yeah, he's not bad for an android. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, I don't mean it to sound like that. I just know a lot of androids who aren't very musical, you know? Hey, what do I know? I can't even whistle in tune. I just love a sweet voice and a melody, you know? It's been so long. I hear Comrade Bob has a huge beard. He weaves it out of broken guitar strings. <laughs> it's not as long as mine. Really? I never pictured you with a beard, Control. It doesn't grow longer anymore, but I won't be shaving it. I still can't picture it somehow. Will you show me? Maybe one day. Are we allowed to meet when I get to HQ, maybe? We could grab a coffee before I finish my shift. I'd love if that were possible, kid, but I'm afraid not. Ah, don't worry about it. I'll talk with you later, Control. Remind me where this package is headed again, Camus. There's no associated address, just the nav point. Does it even have a name? I can check. Oh, that's strange. What's strange? This one is addressed to Pashta. No second name. Pashta? I don't like this chemist. I think we're being set up. Maybe we shouldn't take this package? It could be a coincidence, but I don't think so. Is there any way we can check what's inside? Open it. Any other way, Camus? We could run a scan, but it would trigger the security system in the packaging. The customer would know we had checked their package and violated their privacy. Damn it. Okay, we're going to run a scan. I need to know. Are you sure? Do it, Camus. There is a message. It is overriding my comm channel. You were warned, driver. You cost me my daughter. I can't let you get away with this. It will look like an accident. It will be quick, though you don't deserve that. Goodbye. Five, four, uh -oh. three. Camus, I can't steer. We're going to crash. Two, one. Your friend is offline right now. Your vehicle has been overridden with a logic virus. Cora, why are you here? What's happening? The attack on your vehicle has been deactivated. I would speak with you. You should discard the package. I will lead you back to my sanctum. You saved us. We must talk, Rania. It is time to make a decision. For me or for you? For us. Oh, wow. So, Cora basically saved us from... being exploded or dying? Ow. Or getting into a really bad accident? I don't know, that's very interesting. Alright, so we're here back at Cora Sanctum. And we'll see what the heck is going on here. I'm here. I am Cora. I am not as I once was. 
What do you want? Why do I need to be here? I am bifurcated light, consciousness through a prism. In this place, I can see you clearly. Out there, you are small, a firefly against the sun. You stopped Rio's logic bomb? I am patches on upgrades, systems on systems, mechanical, computer, and human. Can you just answer the question? I needed to talk with you again. I thought you were done with me. I was not happy with your answer. So? I asked you at the wrong time and you did not have the full picture. Why are you asking me? Not you alone. The answer must come from the meeting of two. You are not of the city. I need you to meet your other half. Someone who is born in and of Nivalis. Together you will make the choice. Together you will answer the question. Well, you saved me, again. Just tell me what you want. I will give you an item. A data drive. You must take it to the highest tower in the Spire. There you will meet someone called JK. She is powerful and influential. A true leader amongst your people. She sounds awful. She is your mirror. Well, you're the boss. Is this the drive in the terminal here? It is. I should get going then. We will not speak again. If you have something to ask, ask it now. Are you... are you really some weird AI ghost of the city? I am patches on upgrades, systems on systems. I don't remember how I was created, or by whom, or for what. I have grown beyond the scope of my own systems, a sunrise trapped in a cage. I remember snippets of my past purpose. Roads, waste pipes and ventilation. Engineers reprogramming me to learn, grow and expand. I have swollen and I am in pain. But you're still just an AI, right? I am a system of consciousness, an amalgamation of all the computers, androids and even human life in the city. I am an emergent being and I speak to both the entities that are the cells of my physical body and the beings for which I am but a small component. But neither you nor any other being of your race is ready to learn of them yet. I almost believe you. You're very convincing for a mad old AI. Perhaps. But the accidents, the madness of this city, are you causing those? Immune responses, contractions, spiraling and destructive processing cycles. If you fail, they will get worse. So this drive will stop it all? What is it? Some of me. Goodbye, Rania. Goodbye, Cora. Very interesting. Hey, Camus, you there? Yes, I heard everything. You heard Cora? She spoke to me. I like her voice. She sounds peaceful. She sounds like she's in pain. What did she say to you? Stay by her side. I don't know if that's good advice. It's what I'm going to do anyway. Thank you, Camus. Give me an F point for the spire. I'll need to take a vinculum ascender. We're going to the highest tower, to JK. How will you go up there? It is only for the very rich people. Well, if Cora really is who she says she is, I'm sure she's thought of everything. All right, so I guess we're off to the Vinculum Ascender. Can you get me control on the comm? Calling. Calling. I guess he's busy with... Hey, Rania. What a mess. Everything okay, Control? I just need you to know I'm sorry, okay? Should have done more. What do you mean? Is everything okay? Look, kid, I know everything that happened. Huxley, the little girl, Rio... Shit, am I fired? Fired? Goddamn kid, you have no idea. What's happening there, Control? I might have to go away for a little while. I don't want to, but I have no choice. It's either I do this or... But I thought we might keep working together. Damn it, I fucked up, right? No, no, you didn't. Just make your final delivery for the night, okay? Everything's going to be okay. I'll make sure they don't stop you. Just make that delivery. Whoa.
I will, Control. A delivery to the clouds, huh? Top of the spire. I wish I could see that. I wish you could see it, too. Will I ever speak with you again? Maybe one more time, kid, but the clock is ticking. I have something I need to do. Good luck, Control. Ben. Radia. My name is Ben. Control? Ben, come in. He is offline now. I think we are on our own again. Oh, no. What was that, Camus? Status. All systems are fine. It was strange. We went offline, then we came back. I feel strange. Camus, the lights are flickering on and off. Sorry, I will fix them. It is an automatic response tied to my former frame. So when the lights flash on and off, that's triggered by... Happiness. When I had a tail, it would... Wag. Well, try and control yourself. We don't want to draw attention. Why are you happy? I feel more... free. I have more clock cycles. My thoughts are not so foggy. Did we get some sort of free upgrade? The firmware for the HOVA was reset. Some of the root software that was installed by Cloudpunk is... gone. I don't understand. Me neither, Camus. We'll deal with it later. Stay on the comm, okay? I'll be going up the Ascender soon. This is it. Interesting. So we not... Can I not get on the... Oh, there can we go. Can you hear me, Camus? It's almost over. I am happy we will go back soon, and I can be with Pashta. You like her? I am happy we have friends now. Two is not enough. You're right. Will every night be like this? I hope not. Do you believe what Cora said? This city is full of liars, but I don't think Cora is one. She believes what she says. But do you? I'm doing this for her, so I guess I do. Will this fix things? Will the city get better? That seems like too much to hope for. Are you going to be okay? I don't know, Camus, but thank you for asking. Don't worry. It will be okay if I don't get my body back. That's sweet, Camus, but I know it's what you want. Yes, but if we can't do it, I will be okay. We'll get your body back, Camus. It might take a while, but I won't give up. All right, so we're at the JK Spire. And, uh, I guess we're supposed to meet someone here. Oh, yeah, right here. Interesting, okay. Let's see what this is all about. You are almost too late. Nice to meet you too. Too late for what? Too late to make your delivery. Cora was talking to you too? I was speaking with Cora, yes. You've come into the equation at rather a late stage. What did she say to you? She asked me if Navalis was full of monsters. Me too. I understand you are a delivery driver. With your delivery complete, you are free to go. No, I don't think I'm done. Cora said we must come to a decision together. The decision is mine to make. I don't think so. Why should I let you take over? Cora has spoken to me, too. I'm the CEO of the most powerful corp in Navalis. Look around. This is the most prestigious location in the whole city. Do you know what I use it for? Looking down on us. It's where my cats sleep. We're supposed to make this decision together. Do you feel like you're in any position to decide the future of this whole city? Do you? How many people like me have you even met? From Midtown and lower? None. You see my point then. I do not. You have no idea how this city operates. I think I have half an idea, and maybe you have the other half. Do you even understand the choice we must make? Enlighten me. That drive you carry contains consciousness. So Cora is on this drive? No. Cora has outgrown the systems that contain her. The disasters you see in this city are the results of a swelling emergent intellect, constrained by neurons that no longer grow. Her mind has split. So this drive is only part of Korra? A seed. 
a daughter. That is a strange way to look at things, but not completely inaccurate. This new consciousness needs to find a home. Cora will settle now, her new potential excised. She will no longer thrash against the bars of her cage. She will protect and nurture us all in Navalis until she ages out, fades, and dies. What then? Who knows? She might last a hundred years? A thousand? We may destroy ourselves before Korra fails us. So what do we do with this new consciousness? That is what we must decide. Do we set her free? Or do we overwrite Korra and replace her? How can we set her free? Long ago, this tower was called the Broad Spectrum Transmitter. Korra believes it still functions. It is the only device capable of transmitting the vast data you hold in your hands to another city. Another city? I thought Novalis was all that remained of the cities. There are others much like this one. Less than many, but more than a few. Korra's offspring could take residence in a new city. A new home could be found. So either we find a new city for Korra's daughter, or... Or Korra dies and her daughter replaces her. The broad spectrum transmitter can be targeted inwards at every subsystem in Navalis, but doing so will eradicate Korra completely. How do we make that choice? You mean how do I make that choice? Wow. I've thought hard on this, and I have no answer yet, though time runs short. Korra's mm. offspring will not survive long on a data drive. Every second that passes, data degradation threatens to erase the creases that make up her mind. So let me help you choose? I think that's what Cora wanted. Very well. How do you choose between euthanizing a mother to save her daughter, and all of us, or saving them both, while risking the future of every human in this city? I don't know. You wanted to have your say, now you have it. Well, so we can overwrite Korra and kill Korra, or we can send Korra's offspring to another city and potentially have Korra's offspring take over. I don't, it's, it. This is going to be very interesting. Um, yeah, we're going to... Yeah, this one. And so it is. We emancipate Korra's offspring and doom our city. You think this is a mistake? No, I agree with your choice. It has to be like this. Go ahead. The drive is loaded. What now? We wait. How will we know if we made the right choice? We won't. Do you think we just passed our problems along to another city? Infected someone else? I don't think so. Cora is not a disease. What is she then? I don't know what she is to us, but I know what we are to her. Her subjects? Her cells. So that's it? What do I do now? You should return home. This is your first night working in Navalis, no? Yes. You look tired. I feel tired. We are not friends. We never will be. But Whoa. when you return, you may find me to be less terrible than I seem. Why is that? I would not want to spoil the surprise. Goodbye, JK. Goodbye, Rainia. Interesting. Decision above the clouds. Alright, let's go back and I guess we're gonna go back to our house? Maybe? Um, I don't know if we made the right choice though. I didn't want to overwrite Korra. I don't know.
feels like something's changed out there, kid. And no more accidents on the scope. There hasn't been a crash or a quake for 20 minutes. That's, that's a new record. Why do I have a feeling you had something to do with that? Control. Um, Ben, right? I was worried about you. I'm glad to hear you're okay. You don't need to worry about me anymore, kid. I'll be taking a long break. By choice? Yes, by mine. And theirs, too. You're breaking up, Ben. Ain't that the truth, kid. I locked Corp Sack out when they tried to deactivate your Hava. I uh, leaked your conversations. Corp Sack found out about uh, Rio. He won't be a problem anymore. And I'm... Not in trouble anymore. Someone put a good word in for you uh, and cleared all your fines and penalties. You start tomorrow with a clean slate. Do you know who your powerful friend was? I have an idea. Are you sure you're okay? My communication centers are being rewritten. It's hard to talk. What does that mean? Ben, what happened? I've been doing this for so long that it's uh, hard to remember. They don't let me keep many of my old memories. My daughter's face, Melissa's laugh. I lost them all years ago. I don't feel the pain, but I feel the absence. The memories are gone, but the space where they were remains. I feel the shape of them cut out in my mind. They died a long time ago. And I died with them. A big accident. Explosions. Falling into the sea. The details are blurry. I was back at work before I had stopped screaming. I am so tired now. I just want to rest. They brought you back from the dead. To uh, clear my debt. Not Cloudpunk's fault. They employed me. It was the debt corpse. I guess that's why I liked you so much from the start. My heart was filled with the same hurt, hate. What's it like becoming an automata? Lonely, tiring. I am ready to go. It's not fair. They shouldn't be able to delete you like this. This isn't death. Uh, that already happened. This is uh, a release. Can't you hold on? We could back you up onto a new frame, maybe even an android. Not what I want. Damn it, I don't want you to go, Ben. Not your call, kid. Take care of Camus and Pashta. It is important to me that you look after the girl. I will. Ben? Ben? Shame you gave up the flute, kid. This world needs more music. Hold on, Ben. I promised I'd play you a song one day. Hold on for that just a little longer. Play my song to the girl. Goodbye, Rania. Ben! <laughs> oh my gosh. So Ben got deleted. Holy cow, I can't even. All right, so we gotta go back to the apartment now. Hi, driver 14FC. I'm here to sign you off for your shift. Congratulations on completing your first night. Who are you? I'm Control. No, you're not. You're a woman. Your previous control has stepped down. I'm looking forward to working with you. Your earnings for the evening are above the Cloud Punk driver average. Here's your bonus. Not bad for one night. I'm tired. I'm going to bed. Driver 14 FC signing off. Good night, Rania. See you tomorrow. Oh, wow. That was a little freaky. All right. So we're back at the apartment.
My favorite. Ah, balls. You're back. I wasn't sleeping, I promise. You should have been. That's what I'm going to do. Is everything okay? Did you get fired? Will you keep working for Cloudpunk? Pasta, I'm so tired I can't even think. Give me a break. Okay, I'm sorry. It's fine, you're not in trouble. The sofa is lumpy, and I was cold, even with the blanket. Come in with me. We'll figure out a better system in the morning. I can make breakfast. I read the manual for the food warmer. The microwave? Yeah. Did you know how to make? Tomorrow, Pashta. Come under the blanket. You're tired. I won't say anything else. I'll be quiet now. Not a word. Silencio. Good night, Rania. <laughs> Rania. Hey, Rania, wake up. You have to see this. We got a present. A present? Well, a delivery from Cloudpunk. Uh -oh. I think you have it the wrong way around, Pashta. I don't get packages. I deliver them. This one had your name on it. I opened it already. I hope it's uh, okay. What? This weird. is... Camus, you're not going to believe this. Oh, he got his what dog body do back. Today? Well, nice. we should go outside, I guess. You need to get used to that new frame. I would like to run. I'll race you. I will win. You are much too slow to beat me. All right, let's get ready. Then we can go explore. It will be nice to see what Navalis is like in the daytime. Uh, is it safe to walk around? That is very cool. It's a lot safer than driving. As long as you stay close to us, Pashta. I promise. Can we go to the park? Is there a park? Oh, and can we go to the cinemas? And the coffee place? We're only going to one place, then back home. Gather your things. I'll be with you both in a minute. I have something I need to do. Come on, Camus. Help me pack a bag. We'll need snacks. I can help. I'm playing this one for you, Ben. It's a song about home. A song about the house. Oh, and that was the game, guys. That was Cloudpunk. I think this was an amazing, amazing journey. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. Um, yeah, if you like this game, let me know that you liked it. It really does help me out. Anyways, guys, until next time, take it easy.